O Lord, we have come before you. Honor this declaration in our lives today. Amen. In Acts 16:16, 16, 16, Paul and Silas were chained. But when the manifestation of God's presence came into that environment, their chains broke and their jailer fell and bowed to them. In the name of Jesus, every negativity I have once struggled with will come back to bow to me. Those that afflicted me will come back to bow to me. Those that walked against me will come back and bow to me. Those that rejected me and stagnated me will come back and bow to me. Those that created roadblocks for my destiny will come back to bow to me. Those responsible for my chains will bow. Every affliction that has ever come my way will bow. My health challenges will bow to me. My struggles will bow to me. My opposers and naysayers will bow to me. My haters will bow to me. My rivals and competitors will bow to me. The policies that once worked against me will bow to me. The same gates and doors where I was rejected will bow to me. Every negativity will bow to me. All that God needed to do was shake the foundations of the prison where Paul and Silas were, and all the doors were opened and the chains were broken. The jailer had no option but to bow before the man. Today, I pray, God is about to do a mighty work in me that will cause every negative man around me to bow. God will grant me miracles and favors that will cause even my haters to be at peace with me. Welcome to that new season where every jailer will bow to me. Welcome to that season where everything that once worked against me will bow to me. I declare this in Jesus' name. Comment Amen in the comment section to seal your blessing. Hallelujah.